Everyone knows that starting a small business can be an incredibly difficult endeavor, which is why so many of them fail. But there's also a tremendous opportunity when it comes to helping small businesses succeed. And that's where Deluxe Corp comes in. Here's a company that's now 100 years old. They just rang the bell at the NYSC this morning to mark this anniversary. Deluxe used to be just a check printing play. But in recent years, they've been expanding into adjacent areas to the point where the company now has a whole suite of products and services designed to help small businesses and financial institutions grow. While Deluxe has put up a fairly muted performance this year, it's down 6% for 2015, the transformation continues. And given that the stock is trading just 12 times next year's earnings estimates, it's possible you may be getting a tremendous bargain here. So let's check in with Lee Schramm. He's the CEO of Deluxe Corp. to find out more about how his company's doing and where it is headed on its 100th anniversary. Mr. Schramm, welcome to Mad Money. Good to see you, sir. Thank you, Jim. Pleasure to be here. Have a seat. Thank you. Now, first of all, it really is today, right? Today's it's, birthday. It's actually today. 100 years today, November 23rd. And what's the company look like versus then? Versus what? Versus then, when you started. Incredibly different. Yeah. More innovative, more inventive, unbelievable changes. Now, uh, when you say you're helping out small business, you have a bunch of these. There's lots of different uh, 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 decks and different uh, various reports. But what you're trying to do is help an area of the economy that is still sluggish. I mean, how do you get small business to be moving? Because in the country, it's not doing that well. What we're trying to do is actually get involved earlier in the workflow. So what we want to do is get to the point where we're helping them with brand branding, promoting, and selling themselves. We used to only help with operating, with checks. Now right. we're moving earlier in that workflow, and that's what's really getting them excited. That's where we're able to really help them and help focus on growing. And you made a, a, a key acquisition this year that you really helped that, right? The data, data mix? Data mix actually, Jim, is on the financial services okay. side, but uh, it is an exciting thing for us. And what we're focused on there is really how do we help banks acquire new demand deposit account, okay. account holders? So digital marketing services, a marketing service, but more focused on the, the FI space. All right, so give me an example of what, like I own two small businesses. I have a, a tavern and I have a, an inn. Now those are smaller than uni, but let's say I had a couple of each. What, what could you do for me? What we do is we call from everything from websites to printing to marketing. So we can help you get found, get you a website, get you online. We can help you once you get online with search engine marketing, getting people to find you and your business. We can also do a logo for you so you're branding yourself. We can do anything print for you. We call it on-demand print marketing solutions. So it's that whole gamut, it's that whole package. Everything that helps you promote yourself and get yourself you know, out to your, to your customer. But how do you uh, compete against, say, a Salesforce that's doing that, or a, or a Wix that is designing uh, websites? How do, you, how do you get yourself known? Yeah, it's a, I think it's a total package. There's really two things that we like to tell people. It's our channel reach. So we're online, we're, we're, we get our customers through the banks, we get our customers through uh, what we call major accounts. We have a distributor network, so we're able to surround that small business and find them many different ways. We think that's unique, Jim. We also think what's unique is our is our breadth of products. We have the richness, a lot more richness than some of the, the names of the players that you uh, that you just mentioned. Okay. Now, uh, the check business itself, I mean, you know it's in decline, but it still generates a huge amount of cash. Yeah, really important to us. We always tell people the story. If you're going to invest in the company, you got to understand that we're managing the secular decline of check, right. putting a lot of technology around that right now, very in, in, uh, innovative in terms of what we do there. Then we're gaining share. We're winning uh, share with... Uh, in the FI market, so we've won SunTrust, we've won Citizens, we've won Zions in recent years, and then we're winning on the small business side with all those channels and that channel reach. So it's it's winning there, and then continuing to really put technology around check, and then focusing on the new stuff that we're doing. Will checks forever be in secular decline, or is there a point where it just? I mean, we all still it's that carry asymptote checks. Asymptote question. Yes, right? I mean, I, yeah. I have. A, I always have checks. Yeah. I mean, I, my my kids have checks. Yep. I mean, I, I have to believe that at a certain point, it just stops going down. Yeah, and the, the, but we don't plan it that way. We okay. hope it's that way, but we think we're smart and kind of managing it at about that that six percent decline level. So that allows us to move more quickly and stay focused on the new the newer spaces. Are there a, a company or two that you can just say, listen, they use the Lux? Uh, small business, and this is what it's done for them? Small businesses? Yes. Oh, there's a lot of small businesses. Well, just give me out just an example so people say, oh, yeah, Deluxe was brought in. George we is in my own neighborhood. They're, they're basically a leather and shoe repair place, and I wear my soles terribly, okay. Jim. So they're a, they're a huge customer of ours. They use all, all of our products and services. 
and uh, the people who do the t-shirts and things like that, I mean, that's a, you outsource that? You actually have that We done? outsource that, yeah, we outsource that. We put the logos on it, but we outsource all that. We don't try to do that ourselves. Well, I gotta tell you, it's an interesting pastiche. It's a great mosaic of a business, uh, a, 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 all built around, I mean, a, a brand, a trusted brand that's 100 years old and that I think people feel very comfortable using. Absolutely. Well, Fantastic th story. Thank you very much. Thanks okay, for that's Lee Remy's, the CEO of Deluxe Corporation. Uh, you know, it's just 100 years going strong. Thank you, sir. Thank you, Jim. Yeah. Booyah! Jim Cramer here from Mad Money. Thanks for watching CNBC on YouTube. Click here to subscribe and get the jump on my exclusives with CEOs, plus market news, investing advice, and a whole lot more.